It's been huge, you know, this is my 17th year. And the government has allowed us to go and be the best version of ourselves as people and as athletes, you know, each dollar counts. I think the support of the government has allowed for this tournament to happen. I know I wouldn't be where I am um, in my career with, without their support and funding, and um, I think they've really shown that they support uh, sports. It uh, allows de pouvoir vivre notre rêve et de pouvoir le, le faire à temps plein. Donc, euh, ça demande beaucoup, beaucoup de préparation. Donc, euh, le fait de pouvoir avoir cet appui euh, financier euh, nous permet de justement consacrer toute notre, notre énergie et de ne pas nous soucier là, de vraiment l'aspect monétaire. It's a dream come true, honestly. I think, you know, this is something that will only happen once in my lifetime and once in my career, and I'm going to take full advantage of it. I think, you know, the fact that I get to see my family and friends at a home World Cup and a sea of red in front of us is just incredible. It's going to be incredible. It's a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity. Um, just, you know, can't wait for it. Can't wait for it to start and to be able to, to play in the biggest tournament of your life in front of your friends and family. It's pretty special. I mean, Canadians inspire us every single day. Like, that's what we do. We do it for this. It's not about what's in the back. It's about that flag right over our heart. And this World Cup being in our home country is so special to us. And we hope just to inspire a nation. Ça nous aide aussi à pouvoir nous fixer des objectifs. Puis après, ben quand on quand on arrive dans le Le monde, le vrai monde du travail, si on veut, bien, on, on peut prendre ces qualités-là euh, qu'on a acquéries euh, avec le sport, puis les, vraiment les transmettre là, pour, euh, pour vraiment euh, optimiser notre, notre travail. Up to this point, I've grown so much, not only as a player, but as a woman. And um, I've realized, you know, within the last few years, that it just opens so many opportunities and doors for you. Just a change sport of women's soccer in Canada. You know, I think it, it's on its way up, but I want to see it continue to grow. I want to see the young kids that come out to this tournament, you know, dream of one day being in our shoes and one day representing their own country. My greater goal would be, you know, to inspire our nation. I mean, we've been working so hard uh, on, on the field in this last few years, and I'm just excited to put on a great performance. Well, hopefully the year in sport means a World Cup championship. <laughs> that would be nice. Mais je pense que c'est vraiment très important pour le sport dans la vie de dans la vie de, de tout le monde, mais surtout les jeunes, puis d'avoir l'occasion de pouvoir euh, amener les meilleures joueuses euh, de soccer au monde dans notre dans notre cours en fait au Canada euh, pour vraiment montrer l'importance euh, du soccer puis du euh, puis du sport. Je pense que ça pourrait pas arriver un meilleur un meilleur moment pour pour mêler un peu les deux ensemble. Euh, puis je pense que ça va juste inspirer les gens à, à bouger puis à se lever, à bouger, à être actifs. Euh, puis s'ils font en jouant au soccer, ben tant mieux. So I think the year of sport is bringing attention to something that can help each individual grow in life. And I think it's about growth for each person. I think sport is a great tool. And I think, you know, the year of sport, obviously I'm passionate about sports, so I think it's a great year. But um, I think it's, it's the year of everyone going out and being the best version of themselves. And I think sport's the way to do that.